Okay, so first question. What was the first thing you noticed about Melissa? So what was the first thing David noticed about you? <laughs> Marshmallow. Um, uh, that I was short. <laughs> she had absolutely no boobs, but a beautiful smile. <laughs> At the end, you have to put them all in your mouth. Yeah. All the halves have to go in. <laughs> Where was your first date with Melissa? <laughs> we went um, to with Dana, Donnelly, and Joe to Dana's stepdad's house. <laughs> Los Fajitas. Los. Oh, yeah, well, oh, that's, 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 that's his house. <laughs> Marshmallow. <laughs> He's right. <laughs> He's right. I was thinking the first time we hung out. <laughs> oh, no. Who was who was more nervous at, on your first date at Los Fajitas? Los Fajitas. <laughs> yes, she was so nervous she barely ate, or she just hated the food. I didn't. I didn't eat. I just drank. <laughs> I told her I already ate, so I could down some corona. <laughs> You're lost. <laughs> okay. That's Where, the way I deal with sometimes with having anxiety. <laughs> that's, that's what I do. This is an intervention. <laughs> this is an intervention. Hey, you <laughs> Okay. Where was David's first job? Years ago, we look at Ale House. No, National Gymnastics. Yeah. It's so weird that he didn't follow that. What was the? Wait, so you guys met at National Gymnastics? I'm like, just joking. I know Melissa was a gymnast. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> look at Ale House. What was the name of David's first pet? It's a lifeline. <laughs> it, does it have something to do with candy? It's close to a candy. Sort of, maybe. Hold it's on. close. You're close. You're getting warmer. Give her a minute. Minute. She's starting to shake. Come on. Give her a second. <laughs> maybe I'm thinking of Jason's answer. <laughs> okay, it was... It's, it's not Skittles or Sprinkles or something? Close. Twinkles. Twinkles. <laughs> oh, that was so close. That was close. I think she gets that one. Well, thank you. You don't course. even, I don't even think she needs to eat for that one. That was yeah. a good one. Yeah, you did good. You're, that was a good one. You really tried. Yeah. Okay. What's the most... Oh. What? Did I do that? She did. You did that. What's the most annoying thing that Melissa does? What's the most annoying thing Melissa does? What would he say is the most annoying thing you do? Um. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh, wait, somebody has to be taking pictures of her. You close because it's in the car, but he says you crack your knuckles every time you're in the car. Oh, yeah. And what's the cutest thing? Oh wait, let me let Javi put the mark on. <laughs> what is the cutest thing Melissa does? He says what I do. Yeah. <laughs> what does he think the cutest thing you do is? Ear mops. <laughs> does that have something to do with her? Mm -mm. <laughs> It's something with him. <laughs> it's just something you do. <laughs> I warned him that I would be reading these in front of you, so. Oh. <laughs> Can I block me in? Do you have to run? No, he's, the, you vacuum naked. <laughs> Okay, we all know that 
about Melissa Love's um, Friends, the TV show Friends. What Friends character is Melissa most like, and why? Or just what, what character does he say you're most like? Phoebe. Yes, Phoebe. Sometimes she's a little Phoebe-esque and a little ditzy and flaky and confuses words like camel toe and charlie horse. <laughs> Did you add that in? I added the charlie horse and camel toe. <laughs> but that one you got right, because you said Phoebe. She knows you very well. I know. <laughs> who of Melissa's family and friends were you most nervous to meet? So who was he most nervous to meet, of your family or friends? Her dad? Yeah, her dad. Meeting dads is always awkward. Has Melissa ever farted and blamed it on Jada? Does his head say awkward? Yeah. Yeah? Yes, all the time. <laughs> what is Melissa's favorite thing to cook? <laughs> chicken or pork chops. Take out. <laughs> Take out or chicken ranch because until recently it was the only thing she knew how to cook. <laughs> she got that one. In wrong. her defense, she's bringing home some tilapia lately. <laughs> In her defense. She's trying. You gotta get them all right then. Shove them in the back. We're almost done, don't worry. <laughs> Who does Emma look more like, mom or dad? He would say him. Dad, dad. And he says, Dad, according to Barbara. <laughs> Who does Emma's butt look more like, mom or dad? Yes, mom, with three exclamation points. Who throws more tantrums, Emma or Melissa? <laughs> Melissa on a daily basis. Anytime she doesn't like something, she stiffens up and balls her fist, and her voice gets really high. <laughs> Quite like Emma. <laughs> Your celebrity couple name, is it Gonorella or Pascagono? Gonorella. Gonorella. Look at this TV. No, he says Pascanot. See how it takes so long. No, that was a hard one. Okay, I think, these last, I, think, I think this next one you'll get. Everyone knows Melissa has a ton of nicknames, Kitty, Mel's, Goner. What nickname or pet name do you use most for Melissa? Is it one of those? No, no. Like, what does he say? Oh, boo. Oh. <laughs> boo. He doesn't call you boo. <laughs> Put it in. That was a joke. <laughs> <laughs> you should call her. Who should we do it? <laughs> okay. You need a toothbrush. Oh. A lot of sugar in here. This is the last oh. one. You want to kill me? <laughs> If the soft and soothing voice of radio personality Delilah was going to dedicate a song to Melissa and David's relationship, what would it be? Thank you very much. These are really, really, really difficult. Like, I wouldn't even know what to say. You can say anything at this point. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Your love is like a roller coaster. <laughs> no, this we said just to see you smile. Aww. So now you're done, but you have to thank everybody for coming with the whole marshmallow now. Like, oh, <laughs> <laughs>